Hey guys, so in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to add a photo over your video in iMovie. So you can see I have iMovie right here, but today I'm just going to show you guys how to add a photo like this over your video in iMovie. It's very easy and I just think this is a very helpful thing to know in any editing situation. So let's get started. So if you don't know, iMovie has a one overlay limit. So you can only add like one image over a video. So if I want to add another photo over here, it's just going to add it next to it and not directly over it because it can only have one overlay at a time, which I know is kind of annoying, but that is just how it is. First thing I want to show you guys is just how to add an overlay, the basics to it. And then I'm just going to share with you guys some other tips and tricks that I think will help you in editing. So what I'm going to show you guys now is let's just click on this plus button over here and we're going to go to photos. So now I'm just going to go ahead and choose a photo to add over my video. So this could be text. This could be anything really so let me just choose a photo here so when you have your photo selected you're gonna see you have two things pop up here so if you click on this plus button here it's just gonna add it in as a regular clip so it's not gonna be an overlaid clip but if i click on these three dots click on that you see all these options come up so we have four options here for pictures so the first one is cutaway so that basically just covers up your entire screen so if this were to play audio then the audio of this clip would be playing but this would be showing over that audio so just basically just takes over that entire thing um so that is what cutaway is but just to quickly switch around i'm going to tap on this and click here so here it can change the cutaway to something else so then we also have green slash blue screen you can as tap a color to make transparent so i want all this green to be away tap on that it doesn't really work well if it's not an actual green screen but you get the gist of what a green screen is and then we also have the option for split screen here so that just makes it half of the bottom clip and half of the top clip and lastly the probably the most important one or most used one is picture in picture so this one is probably the one I would use most. So for this option, you have these three op options here at the side. So the first one here, if I tap on this magnifying glass, I can go ahead and zoom the picture in and out of how much I want to show or not. Then these four arrows are to resize my image. And this option here is to remove or add a border around the image. So you can see. So that is basics of how to add a photo over your videos. Now you might be wondering, but I want to add like three different photos over my video. How do I do that? So this method I'm going to show you guys now, it's not bulletproof. It's not the best, but it's the only way you're going to get by with this. So say I want to have three images. You're going to basically want to know basics of where you want your image to be placed. So um say i have this image here and i know i want a picture here here and then here or something like that or just like three in a row okay so i'm gonna go into fonto real quick which is the app i most often use but you can use any app that you can add a photo over and you can export as a transparent background you'll see what i mean so this is what fonto looks like i'm gonna go in here and create a plain image go ahead and choose any color here Go to the sizing option up here and click on custom. So I'm going to click 1280 by 720 as the size, since that is roughly the size we want for our video. And then we're going to go ahead and choose color here. And we're going to go to alpha and drag that all the way down. So this means that there is no background. It's a PNG image. And then we're going to click on this arrow up here and click on use. So now we have our canvas. So like I said, we want three images in a row. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on these three lines down here and click on add image. And then I'm going to add in the image I want to add. So I'm going to make this square, add that in. So I want this to be roughly here. And now I'm just going to quickly add in all three images real quick. So choose any three images or however many you want for your video. So say this is how I want my three images to appear. So what I'm going to do now 
is I'm gonna go ahead and just take these two off real quick off of the image here and then we're gonna go ahead and click appear and then we're gonna select save image as PNG okay so now we've saved that image as a PNG now we're gonna add the second image and I'm gonna click again save image as PNG and now I'm gonna bring in the third image and again select save image as png okay so now once i've done that i'm going to go back into imovie and now how are we going to get this right is we're going to click on this plus button here and we're going to import those three photos after one another so as you can see here this is what it looks like but now the sizing i think is the hardest because you can't like just resize one like so and then have this one be the exact same it's very difficult and it's going to take a lot of time that's why i think I mean, it's a difficult thing to do. As you can see, it looks like that thing's moving. But this is the only way I can find to get like the this result, I guess. But yeah, that's how you can add in multiple photos in your videos. Again, this, like I said, this isn't like a solid proof method. But if you want somewhat of a result like this, this is how, what you're going to have to do. Um, I'm still looking for like better methods for this so I'll let you guys know as soon as I have one this this is the easiest way I can come up with that you can do this I think the easiest way to do this is just at making a green screen video in a different app and then just adding that over in here so um yeah that's all i have for you guys in today's video but yeah you guys get the basics you just click on the plus button choose which image you want to import click on the three dots and select whichever ex like choice you want so picture in picture like i said is the most popular and then you have your photo over your video it's really easy as that so i hope this video was helpful for you guys i know the method that i showed you guys didn't work out pretty well but that's just an example to show you guys somewhat of a method to do that. If you guys did enjoy this video, give it a thumbs up and comment down below any other questions you might have for me. Definitely subscribe. I know most of my viewers are not subscribed, but that really is the only way to support me. And I am reaching for 50k maybe at the end of this month. So please, please subscribe. I would really appreciate that. Click on the video to my previously uploaded video and click on the playlist to see all of my other iMovie tutorials that I think might help you guys. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!